Guys, we have a big-time tag team match coming up here. A big-time match with big-time stakes, Michael. Neither one of these superstars can afford a loss right now. just make or break one of these teams. WWE's most exciting teams ready to go here tonight in tag team action. And I can tell you that the entire tag team division has eyes on this match right now. That's how big this one is. match guys wouldn't you say absolutely michael in fact if you ask me all four of these competitors have what it takes to be top single stars here in the wwe start things off here we're ready to go guys there's nothing like a good old-fashioned tag team match
That'll give you whiplash. In order to be a premier tag team, a superstar and their teammate must have that continuity where they're a well-oiled machine inside the ring. I'm talking about classic techniques like cutting the ring in half, isolating your opponent, relegating them to your corner, and making frequent tags so that the fresh man is always in the ring. That's how you keep your opponents off balance. Corey, a few moments ago, you took us through what it takes for a tag team to be successful. Continuity between tag team partners is crucial. Uh-oh. This just ain't gonna do it. He fights his way free, but how much energy did he exhaust fighting his way out? For many years, members of the WWE Universe and the WWE Locker Room have felt that tag team matches should have two referees. One referee is in the ring overseeing the action, and the other is located out on the floor, making sure teams follow the rules and do not engage in potentially damaging behavior. I think it's a good idea, something perhaps Mr. McMahon might want to consider. Hammerlock applied. Oh, no, no. Uh-oh. Oh! Uh, it's gonna break an arm. This might be it! Oh, my! Byron, earlier you raised a point that people have been talking about for years, and that's a second referee being appointed to tag team matches. I remember WWE Hall of Famer and former WWE President Gorilla Monsoon used to express his strong advocacy for two referees being appointed to tag team matches. Uh, it's something that's been talked about for decades, Michael, and I don't think it's ever gonna happen. We've seen it on occasion, but I think it's best to let the superstars be responsible for themselves. And the appointed official for the match needs to do the job they're paid to do. I don't think it's that much to ask. Specifically targeting the leg. He's on the defensive here. And you have to assume his partner is just in. There it is, the tag has been made. Oh, he needed that in the worst way, Michael. He's starting to stagger a bit, but he's not appearing too worse for wear, at least not yet anyway. Whoa. Guys, it's imperative he gets back in the ring. Yeah, otherwise he's looking at a countout. He wants no part of the outside. He's starting to show signs of fatigue. Oh, this tag team match can get out of hand quickly if he doesn't mount an offense soon. It looks to me like his partner's itching to get in there. And now might be a good time to give him what he wants. <laughs> Taking off his feet here. And it's moves like that that make him so dangerous. Oh, ooh, what impact. Tag team history was made when the first ever SmackDown tag team champions were crowned at Backlash 2016. The unlikely duo of Rhino and Heath Slater caught lightning in a bottle and ran through the tag team title tournament. In the finals, Rhino and Slater took on the Usos to see which team would be the inaugural Tag Team Champions. There was a lot on the line in the Tag Team Tournament Finals. The Usos wanted to add another Tag Team title reign to their resume and enjoyed the recognition of being the first ever SmackDown Tag Team Champions. The team of Rhino and Heath Slater was a team no one expected to be in the finals. Slater had extra motivation because he was fighting for a WWE contract. And at one point, it seemed like the Usos had everything well in hand, but Rhino and... Oh, the backstabber! The big statement! Big trouble! He might just win this thing right here. You don't want to get locked into that move for a long time. That's all right, Cole. Boom! 
<laughs> and that one grounds him. I didn't realize he had such a glass jaw. Oh, look at this aggression, just oh. pure brutality. Come on, easy. Nailed it. This capacity crowd starting to sense the end is near, and I don't disagree. This might be the beginning of the end for him. I'm not sure he has much left. He better be careful. It looks to me like he's one big move away from losing this match. Hook them. Oh, incredible height. Oh, boy, he is rolling. When you talk about great tag teams, we can go all the way back to teams like the Tolos brothers. Stevens and Patterson, Stevens and Bachwinkle, the Texas Outlaws, the Briscoes, the Blackjacks, the Andersons, and the list goes on and on. When you're part of a tag team, the two partners have to travel together, train together, eat together, and be completely in sync with one another. Oh, close to getting a count out here. Nah, this is just some strategic gamesmanship. Devastating elbow. Tag team competition dates back all the way to the early 1900s. Corey, he's looking at it. Neckbreaker. Wow, I'm just as surprised as you guys are. And then, boom! Oh, he's almost there. And he tags his partner in. Momentum has certainly shifted here, Michael. Oh, and he connects. There's no reason to lose your footing on a move like that. Come on, toughen up. Tag team history was made when the first ever SmackDown Tag Team Champions were crowned at Backlash 2016. The unlikely duo of Rhino and Heath Slater caught lightning in a bottle and ran through the tag team top shoulders on the mat. And he kicks out. Too soon. Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. And there's his speed paying off. There was a lot on the line in the tag team tournament. This is it. Rolling elbow right on the mark. This just might be enough for him to take the victory here. Digging deep for a kick out. Nah, not yet. Too early. Oh, the Koji clock's locked in. Here's his chance to win this. And here's another quick look at those superstars in action in that tag team battle. This was another great moment. Yeah, he's putting in the work. I remember this part very well. Ain't nothing better than action like this. That's a nice win for these two here tonight. Tag teams beware, these two guys are legit. And it'll be interesting to see the ripple effects this win has in the weeks to come.